Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with some tips on how you might want to prepare for the new mastery challenges coming in the next update scheduled for Tuesday, June 15th. And if you're watching this video after that date, you can use this as a guide on how to farm XP in Ireland. And if you want more tips on the Wrath of the Druids DLC or on leveling up in general, be sure to check out my AC Valhalla playlist linked in the description below and subscribe to my channel for more guides and gameplay. And I think this leap of faith looks especially cool with Basim's outfit. You can get Basim's outfit through the Ubisoft Connect area. It's free, so you just go to Ubisoft Connect Rewards, and it's a free reward that you can download and then go to your inventory to equip. So the best way, I think, to prepare for the Mastery Challenges as well as get some quick XP here in Ireland is doing these Royal Demands. These Royal Demands are similar to the contracts you can get from Retta at your settlement in Ravensthorpe. But unlike those, these royal demands here in Ireland, you can repeat over and over. So it's not like the daily contracts where you do one or two and then you have to wait till the next day. You can keep doing these missions over and over. And they're pretty quick in this five minute video, I'm going to complete two and get close to a thousand XP. So good way to pick up some XP, help you level up and also to practice killing different types of enemies in different locations, which is what we're going to have to do for the mastery challenges. And if you really want to challenge yourself with these royal demands, you can complete both the primary and optional objectives. For this one I'm doing right now, the primary objective is to clear the camp, and the optional objective, the King's Plea, is to remain undetected, which I have already failed at. I find it pretty difficult to remain undetected, but I am trying to get better at playing stealthy because I have a feeling that will be some of the mastery challenges we'll need to complete for the Raven mastery challenges. So I've just completed this royal demand of clearing the camp and as you'll see I'll get a big chunk of XP as well as some Irish supplies. I got clothing for this one and you'll get a, you'll get more Irish supplies if you complete the optional king's plea. So I'm going to do one more mission for you and of course, to pick up these royal demands, you can go to any pigeon coop in Ireland. I usually go to the one here in Dublin, but there's also pigeon coops in different cities and also near your trade posts. And this royal demand just happens to be right here in Dublin. The main objective is to assassinate the target and the secondary objective is do not take damage. And you can see the objectives in the upper left-hand corner of the screen. You can also look in the quest log. Just keep in mind what the particular objective is. In this one, where you need to assassinate the target, you only need to kill one enemy. Where in the previous mission, clear the camp, you have to kill all the enemies. And there is another mission where you'll need to steal from an enemy. You know to steal jewels. All right, so I've assassinated the enemy. Let's see if I can get away without taking damage. Looks like I am going to be able to do it. Awesome. So for this one, I did complete the king's plea of not taking any damage. And as a reward, you'll see at the end of this mission, I will get 45 clothing instead of 30 like I did in the previous clip. So I got 50% more Irish supplies by completing the King's Plea. So I have completed two Royal Demands really quickly, picked up a bunch of XP, and so I recommend doing this both if you want to pick up some XP as well as practice with completing challenges to get you ready for the Mastery 
challenges coming next. This is Amber. Subscribe to my channel for more tips and tricks for Assassin's Creed Valhalla.